Good morning from New Orleans. Jackson and I are here for a 30th birthday party for our friend. We are staying the full weekend and I'm gonna take you along on the things that we eat, drink, and do along the way, starting with coffee from a local coffee chain. And now we are just exploring. It's Sunday morning. We're staying through Monday night and we're very excited to get into it. Beignets are on the list. Muffalata sandwich is on the list. What else is on the list? What's not on the list? What's not on the list? That's right. Last night we went to Bourbon Street. I'm gonna insert just a few clips here, but honestly, it was not the one to vlog. So we are starting fresh this morning and we're just walking around, so come along. Everybody for brunch now at Compare Latin, and it should be a good time. We are a group of like 25, so meals are absolutely chaotic. But I'm hungry for breakfast, even though we did just have that, so I'm excited to eat.
welcome to our last day here in New Orleans. We are just exploring the French Quarter and came across this really cute Cafe Beignet location. It is the most aesthetic, so if you are looking for good beignets, we had them yesterday but from a different one and they were solid. So this one looks adorable. Next up is some coffee somewhere and then we're just going to keep walking around and eventually try to get a spot at Cafe du Monde because, you know, that's what you do when you're here for the first time. It is the most touristy beignet spot, but we just have to have it at least once. <laughs> Spices, I recommend checking out Rouse's. It's a little grocery store on a corner on Royal Street and we were able to get some Creole seasonings for around six, seven dollars each and I plan on gifting them to everyone in my family because we are all equally into that. but I actually ended up getting a uh, New Orleans iced coffee with chicory coffee, so I'm gonna try that. It does add a little bit of like woody, woody undertones. street of restaurants a little bit outside of the French Quarter by water. We're currently walking down Royal Street but way further down and there are some really cute colorful homes and leaf blowers. This walk is a little like Brooklyn <laughs> and a little bit abandoned but there are lots of cool murals that we just walked by. It's been a really cool walk. There's lots of like houses and interesting art and art places. The Jamnola was on our way. And yeah, it's very chill over here compared to the French Quarter that we're staying in. It's really nice. It's because it kind of was because 
it was a 30th birthday party so we were doing a lot of different events with very large groups but we tried to sneak in some sightseeing and some walking around in between there my two favorite streets were magazine street in the garden district as well as royal street in the french quarter and kind of out here too in saint claude claude i apologize if i butchered names i probably did a bunch i also really liked cafe beignet and there are so many more things that we didn't have to do that I would love to come back for. But our Uber is here. We're headed to the airport. Thank you so much for watching and bye!